Hey, what's up, guys? In this video, I am gonna show you how to add video or document to your iPad, iPhone, iPod in order for you to be able to use with your third-party application. Okay, so what you need: the latest version of iTunes, video or document that you want to copy to your device and the application that can play your video or view or edit your document on your device okay in my case I have a video on the desktop here you see and I have uh, an app on my iPad 2 which is called Ace Player it is uh, a, a, a video player uh, right now I want to copy this video uh, in, into my iPad 2 and play with Ace Player okay so the first step is to connect my iPad 2 into the computer and I already connected it and you see uh, after you connect your device uh, into your computer um, you run your iTunes and you see in the left hand side is your device just simply click on the left hand side here click on your device and then uh, usually it shows up here this screen is uh, just a summary don't bother about this just go to apps see and then scroll down, scroll down to the bottom until you see this. This is called file sharing. Uh, and then you see here apps. They list all third party applications that are that uh, support a document, you know, like you want to add. Uh, some document to that application so yeah I you see ace player here I click on it and on the right hand side here ace player documents and here is the list of the document that belong to uh, this application see right now I don't have anything so because ace player is a video player the document here uh, will be the video okay now I want to add my video on the desktop into this iPad 2 and play with this ace player so I will click on that I go to the desktop here the document is here you see open and it will load up okay here you see here's the document and well, you're good to go. That's it. You go to your 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 device and you you can play it. Oops, I'll forget. Uh, there is the other way for you to to add video into your iPad, or your your iPhone, your iPod. You by by going to this mo movie, but uh, and you click send here. And it will send all your, the the movie in your uh, library, iTunes library, into your device. But I never use this, and I will not recommend you to use this either because uh, this by doing this you will uh, use your default movie player that was built in uh, with your iOS device and you know that built-in app cannot play AVI file, WMV file it cannot play these popular files so I think it's better to use a third-party application like the one I have here it is free application you can go to app store search for it that's free completely free 
download it and you can play a lot of types of video you know okay that's all thank you